Music is teaming up with a local improv comedy troupe to produce a three-part virtual sketch and improv series that parodies TV news shows. Uh-oh, our Leanne Trotter has a preview. Welcome to Black and White News, The Plan. It's not real news, it's a brand new virtual improv show written by a couple of Second City alums who are also members of Preach, a spoken word improv comedy troupe made up of people of color. So basically you're taking what we talk about on the news and making fun of it? Yes. 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 And they just give you a different perspective, especially uh, uh, from the, the, the black point of view, the vast black experience in America exactly. point of view. It's also different from the news because it is being framed racially and satirically. So it's not, we're not like non-biased as news people are, or should be. <laughs> we are biased. Back in June, Andrew Alexander, Second City's longtime co-owner and executive producer, resigned amid allegations of racism, and Second City committed to creating a more inclusive environment. For years, we have felt so marginalized, so pushed to the side there so like we want you we want this black voice because of diversity and inclusion but we really want you to kind of be quiet once we give you the job in november second city hired john carr to be the new executive director and this new partnership with preach is part of the effort to diversify second city's programming why are we still going through so much segregation in our city why um doesn't two billion dollars is going to chicago police department going to getting an instrument in every kid's hand on the south and west side every kid's hand uh computers um th that's the stuff that we're talking about black and white news the plan combines spoken word with long-form improv the first of three shows debuts thursday at 7 p.m on tixar.com tickets are 15 dollars per household leanne trotter nbc5 news right, thanks to leanne definitely check it out 